First time ever we're going to be able to give people peace of mind. Mayor Bill de Blasio on Monday said again he is taking a Vision Zero approach when it comes to children exposed to lead. This time sitting next to his sanitation commissioner, Catherine Garcia. Now the city's lead czar, who helped lead a 90 day review of all city agencies' approach to lead prevention. When is it going to get done? Will there be SWAT teams? There was some word that there might be SWAT teams going into tests that fast. Could you tell me more about that? This will start this year. It is uh, using the latest technology that literally can look through all of the layers of paint that have ever been there and determine once and for all if there's any lead paint. For the first time, the mayor promises to test every apartment, public or private, for lead. That includes 135,000 apartments in New York City public housing. SWAT teams, yep, there's going to be fast efforts when. I'm using a term that you're using, but I agree with the idea of urgency. Back in April at the Queensbridge houses in Long Island City, we first asked the mayor about the growing concern among families inside NYCHA. What about lead? A lot of families that I speak to every single day are concerned they have lead in their homes with small children. They say not, not enough is being done about the lead crisis. They're Again, calling it I a crisis. I would urge you to look at the facts more. For months, PIX11 News told the stories of families with children affected by lead inside public housing. Then last August, the city revealed over 1,100 children inside public housing were exposed to lead. We asked the then New York City Health Commissioner on her last day on the job if she had any regrets about the confusion of the numbers. The numbers have gone from zero to seven to 29 to then 800. Is there a sense of regret? Do you have a sense of regret as the Health Commissioner? I do regret the swirl of numbers. Under Lead Free NYC, the city will screen every apartment, public and private, but also target unsafe consumer goods, provide children with dedicated nurses, and promises all city agencies will work together to respond to lead exposure in children. Why should families trust you inside NYCHA that this is the accurate? Local Law 1, the law of this city, requires annual testing. And that's what we have been following that law and completing those annual tests and acting on it. In the Bronx, Monica Morales, Pix 11 News.